Hi, this is Heather with Autism Chrysalis. Since I've become more active in both coaching and aut autism advocacy online, people have asked me lots of questions. Here are the three questions that I get asked most often. But trigger warning, this is going to be a very blunt answer. Question one, how do I get out of burnout without changing much in my life? Question two, how do I find friends without putting myself out there and risk getting hurt because I've been hurt too much and people are crap? Question three, how do I know what I want or to make decisions without rocking the boat for anyone? The answer to all of them is you don't. You can't get out of big, you can't get out of burnout without making significant changes in your life. You can't find new friends or de deepen existing relationships without risking getting hurt. And you can't figure yourself out without rocking the boat. Broken down to its essence, you can't feel better in a system that hurt you without changing the things that hurt you in that system, or at least your very small part of it. You don't have to go out and change the whole world before you can feel better, thankfully, but you do have to make changes in your life, your work, relationships, your internalized ableism, anxiety, and all the other crap that's sapping your energy and holding you back from your power. Which is exactly what the system wants. Because when you do break free of swallowing its lies and hate, you'll be able to affect real change for yourself and for others. And that means that the system will have to change. And it doesn't want that. It wants the status quo. The system wants you to believe that you're the problem and it's willing to do anything to make you hurt enough and be scared enough to sit there and stew in your own negativity so that you'll never take the risks needed to make things change. And it will be a risk. I promise you, it's not going to be easy. It's going to hurt, and it's not always going to work out well. But things aren't exactly Peachy King right now, are they? So what are you going to do? Are you going to do the hard work to heal your own crap and keep tweaking things until you've got some real progress, even when it's unfamiliar and scary sometimes? Or are you going to write me off and say I'm full of crap and the world doesn't work that way and complain that it's not fair? That is a genuine option. Lots of people choose that every day. You're welcome to too. And I mean that genuinely, not sarcastically or as a form of reverse psychology. You get a genuine choice. And you're right, it's not fair. It is so fucking unfair. And that's the way it is. So what are you gonna do?